Rheinmetall Donnell Munition held an impressive firepower demonstration recently at Donnell's Overberg test range in South Africa. During Ammunition Capability Demonstration 2019 on 19th and 20th of March, weapons ranging from small arms to 155mm artillery were fired from the ground and the air in the presence of Ministry of Defense and military officials from all over the world. It was a good opportunity for the South African Army, which recently withdrew peacekeepers from northern Darfur and is mainly involved in domestic operations such as policing, refugee camps, border protection, and anti-poaching operations to put their kit through the paces. The service fired small arms, medium and heavy machine guns, 60, 81, and 120 millimeter mortars, 40 millimeter illumination, smoke, flashbang, and smoke grenades, which were also thrown. Armored vehicles fired their main armament and coaxial machine guns and tube and rocket artillery delivered illumination and high explosive rounds. Multiple rocket launchers captured during the war in Angola in the second half of the last century and still in South African service lived up to their World War II nickname Stalin Organ. South African armor demonstrated maneuver warfare. Overhead, South African Air Force Gripen and Hawk fixed wing and Roy Valk Lynx and Oryx rotary wing aircraft fired their onboard cannons and machine guns, delivered ordnance and dispensed flares. Helicopters also inserted troops. There was even a South African Navy Otomelara 76mm gun firing from firm ground. South African engineers demonstrated mine breaching with the Plofader mine breaching system. Much of the kit on display has been in South African military service for some time, but Danel and Rheinmetall also used the opportunity to show new products. One of these products was Rheinmetall Canada's Mission Master Unmanned Ground Vehicle, which fired a salvo of 14 Talas 70mm rockets, delivering 60 kilograms of explosives in 1.6 seconds, controlled by a single soldier through his PDA.